Mmm. Oh man. Yes. 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 Yes to these. Yes. Mmm. -hmm. So good. Hey everyone, it's Vicky. So my parents went to Cambodia on vacation and they brought me back all the snacks. They also brought me back the Cambodian version of a Hawaiian shirt. Gotta love the elephants. All right guys, let's start tasting. The first thing I wanna try are these snacks. Lala. Let's see. They look kinda like what was that cereal? Um, Cocoa Puffs? Remember? Do you remember it? I'm not alone, right? Let's try it. Mmm. Okay, it's kind of like a styrofoam texture. A crunchy styrofoam, that's what I would call it. And yeah, it reminds me of Cocoa Puffs or Cocoa Krispies, like that kind of cereal puff. <laughs> Sweet, cocoa-y, puffy, crispy styrofoam. I'm down. If you guys know me, you know I like spice. That's the thing. So I'm super excited to try these green peas with sriracha on them. Let's do this. <laughs> they kind of remind me of wasabi peas. but they're sweet and spicy. Mmm, oh man, yes, 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 yes to these, yes. Mmm, Cambodia, you do it right. This stuff's good. Mmm, -hmm. so good. Yes, mmm, 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 yeah. Yes, oh my God, yes, 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 Oh, it's so good, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, mm. Oh yeah. Mm. Anyone I know who ever goes to Cambodia, send me more. Please, send me more. I'm gonna guard these with my life. Warning, right now, this goes out to my brother. If you're watching this, these are mine, do not take them. Okay, so I'm just gonna say right now, my parents weren't sure if some of these were from Cambodia or if they were from neighboring countries. This one might be from Vietnam. It looks kind of like Vietnamese, the writing does to me. I mean, versus like the Cambodian writing. Cambodian writing looks a little more like Thai, but I think Vietnamese does the Latin letters. I'm not sure. At any rate, they got these in Cambodia, so we'll call them Cambodian snacks. I'm not sure if they are. You guys can let me know in the comments. So this is a jackfruit chip. I like jackfruit, actually. If you haven't had it, I recommend you try it. Uh, I need scissors. Ooh, wow, that's, that's pungent. All right, let's try it. Mm. Okay. To be honest, it tastes like one of those dried apple chips. Same texture, same kind of taste. Look at this cutie on the package. Hello, how are you? I think these are potato chips. I can't really tell. It's O Star Story. And on the back it says, wow, wow. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. These are potato chips. Hmm. I like them. They aren't as greasy as American potato chips. Mm -mm -mm. They remind me a little bit of Pringles. Mmm, they're good. So someone already got into the mangoes clearly here. <laughs> but I love dried mango. So let's see what dried mangoes taste like from Cambodia. Mmm, good. Mmm, super sweet. This is like eating a bubble tea. Mmm, so good. Palm seed? I don't really know what this is. It doesn't really have a smell. Mm. 
It doesn't really have a taste. So these are chocolate almonds. Super excited. Look at that, they're in the shell. And they have a coating of uh, chocolate powder on them. How do we un unshell this? Am I supposed to eat it with this shell? No. Maybe I'll suck up my shell. Or it's chocolatey powdery. I don't think you're supposed to do that. Let's try a new one that I haven't sucked on. <laughs> okay, here we go. Mmm, they're good, they're kind of sweet. They don't taste very chocolatey to me, but it's yummy. It's a little bit salty. It doesn't taste like chocolate. I don't know what it tastes like though. I really don't know. I'm sorry guys. <laughs> Bless my parents for bringing me back snacks. Original Thai coconut milk crispy rolls. Mmm. That's flaky, crispy, bakery goodness. Is that coconut? But it doesn't really taste like coconut. If you like pastries, I think you'll like this. <laughs> okay, so now we've got Cambodian dried durian. It looks like it's covered in a powder of some sort. Ugh. Oh my god. The more I chew it, the worse it gets. Oh god. Ugh. 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 Mm. Ugh. Wow. I'm sure someone out there likes this. Otherwise, they wouldn't make it, right? What would I describe it as? I have to eat another to tell you what it tastes like because I don't know how to describe it. Okay. Here we go. We start off and it seems kind of sweet. And I think it's going to be good, maybe. And then, ugh, it's like a root or something. But like a gross root. It's like you're in the forest and you're just eating a tree root. Oh God, and that aftertaste. Ugh, oh God. Come back to me, sweet, handsome boy. Oh, gross. That one, oh. Now that I tried those durians, I'm ready to have the greatest taste. <laughs> Can't tell anything about this except that it is onion flavored. Yes! I think I found the Cambodian version of Funyuns. Check this out. Yep, smells like onion. Mmm. Yep. Yep. This is Cambodia's Funyuns. Mmm. Mmm. Good stuff. Yeah. And the last thing I have is this Mara chocolate, which has Kampot pepper in it. Kampot? Kampot. I don't know. My parents told me that this pepper is everywhere in Cambodia. <laughs> they wrap it up real nice. Wow. Look at that. Is, is that the pepper on here? Mmm. Ooh, that's pepper. Here we go. Are you ready? So, imagine a chocolate bar. Someone took a bunch of table pepper next to the salt. They took the pepper and dumped it into your chocolate. That's what this is. It's not bad. Okay guys, this was crazy. This was a lot of snacks, but it was fun. I think the winner is definitely these sriracha peas. These are so freaking good, guys. They're so good. <laughs> anyway, remember to give this video a like. Definitely smash that like button if you haven't right now. Do it right now. And subscribe to me. And make sure that you hit the little bell icon to turn on notifications, because otherwise you won't know when I upload. 
Okay guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.